Hey guys. Hey guys, hey. <laughs> hey guys, hey. Um, we have been to Mar M and S. Oh, yeah, Mark Spencer's. Spencer's. That's right, yeah. So we've been to Marks and Spencer's because we wanted to get the cake in a jar. I don't know if you guys can see it from there or not. <laughs> I expect it to be a little bit bigger. Yeah, they are four pounds and yeah, that but they are popular because that out. was the only one that was left. But it seems like there's the raspberry ripple one which we got, then a Colin the Cat and Pillar or Trillionaire's cake. Oh, I see why to try all them ones as well. <clears throat> we'll have to just is there another one somewhere else? Is that where we're going later? Yeah, there's one like you know with that cost of coffees that we've been before. Maybe I'll have a look in there, because I'm going to try, try the Colour the Caterpillar. Oh, obviously, you worst comes to worst can buy Colour the Caterpillar. Anyway, yeah, so this is how big the jars are. Yeah, it's a lot <laughs> smaller. <laughs> so we'd never see it in person. I mean, we thought it was going to be one that you could share. Yeah, I mean, we are going like, to share it anyway, but... Like a big, yeah, a big um, jar, but... Are we being greedy? Probably. I know, but no, yeah. I think we're just going off the price. Yeah, oh yeah, I suppose four pounds is a lot to pay for a cake in a jar. Yeah. But so let's see, is it? Maybe it'll be amazing. So it does look pretty on the top. Looks pretty. We've obviously made a bit of better. Yeah, it would be interesting. You don't even get like a glass jar at the end of it to keep. Yeah, it's a shame. It's not glass. So I'll if you hold that, I'll scoop. The yeah, whole it's thing on a spoon. Really? Yeah. Three, two, one. So obviously it does have good flavours. Yeah. It's just whether the flavours justify the price. I suppose out of all of them, the raspberry apple's probably the more, more basic sounding, but then again, Colin the Caterpillar, that's just What like is the Colin the Caterpillar? It's pretty much just a chocolate covered Swiss roll with Caterpillar. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's nice. There's obviously lots of buttercream, lots of the raspberry. Hmm. Yeah, it's nice. Where it's worth four pounds, right? I can imagine it probably, once the hype's died down, it probably go on an offer to be a bit more. Because can you imagine a cake the same size, but just in a box, being four pounds from Marks no. and Spencer's? Or maybe Marks and Spencer's, but not somewhere else. I know Marks and Spencer's can be a bit more expensive, but I don't think they'd have the thingy to it's just cool. charge. So with this one I feel like I want to keep the jar just because I feel like I've paid a premium for this <laughs> jar so. <laughs> Marks and Spencer's don't do too good to go to Well only they, they have some that one in form the area that's part of. I only mention that just so I could put too good to go in the title. <laughs> <laughs> so hey guys. Hey. Um, Quickly before we get started, I'd just like to thank everyone that has subscribed so far. Mm -hmm. We both, well, all three of us really appreciate it. And thanks for all the people who give us the likes and any comments. Yeah, we love seeing and reading them. Yeah, we read every comment. <laughs> like it'd be hard not to. Yeah, it'd be hard to always. But yeah, yeah, so we just want to, before we start anything else, just like say thanks. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> There's the cross section of the mil is it the trillionaires or the millionaires? I don't know, you've got the... the trillionaires cake jar, that's the cross section. And here's the Colin the caterpillar. And here's the cross section of the oh there we go. Here's the cross section of the Colin the Caterpillar cake. Four pounds each for Marks and Spencer's. <sighs> Worth. Yeah. Is it worth it? Worth every penny. So I suppose we'll try the trillionaires one first, shall we? Yep. And so oh, it says Madeira sponge cake laid with salted caramel sauce, chocolate ganache, fudge cubes, and milk chocolate biscuit balls. Something in my eye. I just can't let me have that mount moment. <laughs> and so there is the top. It's got some. Chocolate biscuit balls and fudge pieces. Uh, yeah. So to guess, the idea is that one person is supposed to eat this cake. Eat. Does it say like the serving, like no, the serving size? It doesn't actually even tell you. 
It doesn't say how many people it's for, does it? It doesn't say how many people it's for, and it doesn't tell you like, how many calories are in it. Oh, I wonder gosh. if what that is. Maybe that's it. Yeah, that's a bit. That's a thing. Wow. These places were allowed to sell things like that didn't have the. I'm going to complain. Yeah, that came out quite easy. Thing is, Aaron's not a big fan of salty caramel, but he does really like the salty caramel brown. He's only from yeah, but there's something else that I like. Oh, yeah. it's the exam tip. Yeah, but <laughs> you don't know about those. So we're not like a bigger version. Yeah, because I know that they do a bigger version of that, the raspberry ripple one. And we all know about the colony caterpillar. We do. And if any of you guys have actually seen the Cuthbert the Caterpillar in Aldi, because we've looked in is it, two Aldis and no sign of any of the rip-off one. <laughs> uh, I mean, the one that is supposedly having some... The space. Aldi original. That's nice. Obviously, we've got our cups of coffee to help cleanse our palates in between. Do you think you'd have been able to eat a oh, whole one of these? No, I'm already getting kind of full of it. I, don't, I definitely couldn't have had this without a coffee. It's very rich, very sweet. Obviously the raspberry ripple one was a lot easier just because it wasn't as decadent. Mm, it was a lot more What's the word? Not fresh. What's the word? If, even though it wasn't like light, light tasting. Yeah. Even though it was quite sweet, <coughs> and it probably was mainly sugar as well. When something has fruit flavourings in it, it makes you feel like it's one of your five a day. Mm. I think my favourite part is the chocolate balls. Is it? When you get the chocolate balls, it just gives you a nice change of the texture and. And so how I'm going to eat another half. <laughs> so, on to the next one. So we've saved the most famous to last, the Colin the Caterpillar. I wouldn't like to say which would be the most popular. Well, I'd say my favourite so far is the raspberry one. So I, I did like that one, but it was quite... I don't think you could eat it on your own, I just don't. It just was very decadent and very rich. Now this one, I think they might be surprised when we open the top. Mm. What's it gonna be? Ta da! <laughs> Colin's oh. little face. I suppose they had to put the Colin the caterpillars. <clears throat> little face little in face. there somewhere. Just so it's not just chocolate cake. It's, it's this, you've got white and milk chocolate chips on top land all the way through. So I think I might... So it's just basically a... Yeah, just white chocolate. Yeah, white chocolate. Does it taste nice, white chocolate? Yeah, it tastes... Suspicious, is I milky? <laughs> I think... Can they do that? You've no. tried it. I melt it there. down. I feel like you've given me loads more. Oh. I feel like there's still loads in there for me. <laughs> I think I'm going to like this one just because it looks like it's going to have nice texture with all the different chocolate chips. Oh, you can see like the gooey chocolate bit as well, which is... Yeah. See, so, yeah, it's very saucy. Just what I needed before a night shift. Mm. Mm. But I really like all the chocolate chips and they've got the white chocolate chips as well as milk chocolate chips. Have I said chocolate chips enough yet? Mm. Yeah, so you expect this to be heavy. It but it's not, for the, ma for the main part, it's not too bad, man. No. I think it's the other one, it had a thick, stodgy, salted caramel and a thick, stodgy thing. Like I said, I think the chocolate sauce in here is a bit lighter than the chocolate chips really help give you a different texture. If I had to choose my favourite, I think it would be Colin. I still think my favourite is the raspberry one. Although controversial, I don't think I've ever had a V call in the caterpillar cake myself. I know my sister usually gets it for her children, but 
we, we never get to see any of that. No. A lot of people seem to get them for the birthdays, don't they? But yeah. I've never had one for my birthday. I don't think you have, as far as I'm aware. <laughs> Here he comes. So you best not be eating without me. <coughs> and here's our little Pugga Pilla. Just come to Hello. join in. You wouldn't eat any of the stuff by me. So yeah, I'd say they're a very they are all pleasant to eat, but very rich to get through. <clears throat> Would I again pay four pounds for one jar? I personally wouldn't. I wouldn't. But yeah. And you think you're just paying just to have it in a jar? Hmm. No, it's not even a glass one that you can keep. No, it's just a plaque still. But obviously it has hard to get through. Novelty value which Drew is in. Yeah, well it seems to sell out a lot of people have bought them, so. So yeah, I'd say it gives gets a thumbs up but not a repurchase, not unless it was on an offer. <laughs> it was on an offer, yeah, maybe, but even then. Yeah, even then it might be a little bit. Maybe it's because we ate two in one go. I don't know. But if you meant to have eaten one of those two, so I'll yeah, feel like... Yeah, say. I just the only difference like... is you'd have the same flavour all the way through. Mm. And I wouldn't have been very keen on that. Mm. Yeah. So, yeah. <clears throat> That's us trying our little... Woo! <laughs> I know. I don't know how I'm going to sleep tonight after having coffee, coffee and, and soup here. So yeah, that was just us trying the M&S cakes. Let so us it, know if you guys... Yeah, if you tried the cakes, tell us which, what you thought of them and which your favourite was if you tried more than one. Yeah, that's, that's it. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Speak to you guys later. Bye. Bye.